Hello and welcome to Indian News. You are watching English Bulletin with me, Ratnakar. The news in detail. On Friday, a review meeting was held in the presence of First Minister Nitin Raut in the Divisional Commissioner's Office regarding the rising corona infection in the city. In this meeting, Divisional Commissioner Sanjeev Kumar, District Collector Ravindra Thakri, Commissioner Tukhara Munde, and Commissioner of Police Bhushan Kumar Mupadhyay, Lok Pratinidhi were present. In this meeting, the growing statistics of rising infections and deaths were discussed in the city, as well as measures were planned on it. After the meeting, First Minister Nitin Raut said that the people should support the administration. This all rules, regulations, instructions are for them. So people who feel that they have symptoms of COVID, they should come forward for the test by giving information to Nagpur Municipal Commissioner. Nitin Raut said that the delaying in the finding out the infected people due to this, doctors are failed to treat patients on time. That is why the corona cases are increasing. Under the leadership of President Prashant Pawar, Jai Jawan Jai Kisan Sangatan requested Nagpur Municipal Commissioner Dukaram Monday on the problem of security guards of the Nagpur Mahanagar Palika. Sangatan approached and stated their problems to the additional commissioner because Commissioner Monday was with the first minister in the on the review meeting. Prashant Pawar said that for the protection of NMC, security guards are kept by a private company. But due to corona epidemic, a large number of companies have fired security guards from the job. Power said that if all these are not kept on job or till Monday, then there will be a protest in front of Nagpur Municipal Corporation office. The virus is rapidly spreading in the city even after following all the safety norms. Today, employees of three different banks were tested positive with COVID-19. An employee of Union Bank of India Regional Office, Ramda Spate, was tested positive today. ICICI, Sriram, Trawar, Sadar and Kotak Mahindra Bank, Shankarnagar, Dharampet, all the respective branches have been temporarily closed for safety purpose. Sanitization of the places will be done by the authorities. After a long wait, the cyber police station will start functioning at the cyber cell in the administrative building at Civil Lines. As per the information, total 75 personnel have been appointed for the police station. The state government had declared that it would be starting a cyber police station in the year 2016. However, lack of manpower delayed the project. The point to be noted here is that around 5,000 cases of cyber fraud are reported to the cyber cell every year. In the last even and half month, cyber frauds were about 2 rupees 5 crore have been reported. The police station built to help MSEDCL has closed two years ago. Officers and personnel of this police station have been posted in different police stations. Similarly, the Bank of Maharashtra has also freed nine personnel deployed in the security of Bank of Maharashtra. This man force has been deployed in the cyber police station equally. As we know, the number of COVID-19 patients is increasing day by day in the city. In view of this, Vithwari and Maskasat Wholesale Kirana Bazar Association has decided to shut down wholesale market at Itwari and Maskasat on every Saturday and Sunday. The decision to this effect was taken in the meeting of the office bearer of the association. The association has taken this decision in view of the danger posed to the health of the shop shopkeepers and their employees. Both the wholesale market would remain closed until further instructions. The demand for grocery items has increased manifold during COVID-19 pandemic, due to which rush of people in the market has gone up. This poses danger to the health of the citizens and shopkeepers and their employees in particular, as it is extremely difficult to identify COVID-19 suspects. Hence, association has decided to keep Itwari and Maskasat wholesale Kirana market closed on every Saturday and Sunday. There is a matter of worry for Nagpur citizens as on Friday, Corona blasted in the city with more than 56 new cases due to which this figure has now reached to 7,747. Also with 40 more patients succumb in the city, the fatality count has gone up to 269, while 252 patients recovered today. These all positive cases were tested and are reported from various hospitals, IGGMC, GMC, EMS, NIRI, MAPSU, Private Lab, Antigen, other testers. Well, that's all in this bulletin. For more updates in and around the city, stay tuned with NBC News. Till then, Ratnagar says goodbye. Please take good care of yourself.